The eight participants are some of the most brilliant female captains of the Tunisian Air Force. The experienced pilots will be subjected to thorough mental, physical and health examinations to select the final candidate and her replacement. This is a historic achievement and a step forward for women in science. The success of this project is success for all Tunisians. Tunisia will shine thanks to its talents. This space mission will inspire generations of women and youth to work in the scientific field and to reach space. The two selected female candidates will receive one-year training at the Russian space agency Roscosmos before joining the International Space Station on a mission lasting 10 days. The astronauts will handle a scientific mission in physics and medicine. This space mission will be made in coordination with the international research centers and in partnership with Tunisian specialists here and abroad. The scientific experiments will be done for the first time in the world. The results of this mission will contribute to the service of humanity. The current occupants of the International Space Station sent a message to the Tunisian candidates expressing their support for the project and their expectations to welcome the first Tunisian astronaut in her upcoming mission. I am very happy to realize this dream. Being pre-selected for this space mission is already a privilege and an achievement. I thank you very much for giving us this chance to dream for ourselves and for all Tunisian women. We are inspiring all Tunisian women. We are being courageous for all women. I'm captain of a 360J plane. I'm married. I have two daughters. Thank you for this invitation and this opportunity which is unique. I hope to have the honor to raise the country's flag in person in the space station. Telnet Group said the idea of the first Tunisian and African astronaut was born two years ago before materializing this month with the official launch of the project. Telnet Group announced that the project of the first Tunisian and African astronaut has received the support and encouragement of the Tunisian government and the president. The International Space Station mission will be held in 2024. Adnan Shawishi, CGTN, Tunis.